good morning children how are you fine okay now yesterday we have completed the exercises of part first second third fourth i hope you have completed in your copy or register and learn also today we will start the question answers you have purchased all the books now because books are necessary i told you before and uh, we will mark in your book here you can look there the first question part fifth answer the following questions what was the term used for the indian subcontinent answer is you can write there bharat varsh and ya or hindustan this is answer question number 2 which countries comprise the indian subcontinent you will write there there are six countries come on page number 2 here you can look there first paragraph second line afghanistan pakistan nepal india bhutan and bangladesh this is answer number 2 okay now question number 3 you can omit it leave it cross it question number 4 throw light on the sources of medieval india this answer is on page number 5 look the page number 5 here you can look there archaeological sources in archaeological sources in the archaeological sources we include ancient monuments inscriptions and numismatic or coins and literary sources autobiographies chronicles documents etc so you will write there both this paragraph and this paragraph this will be the answer number part fifth question number 4 okay now question number 5 is also omit cut it no need to do now give reasons here question number 1 inscriptions are considered an important sources of source of history you will write from question also inscriptions are considered an important source of history yahan tak aapko isme se likhna hai as as likhne ke baad page number 5 pe aaiye फर्स्ट साइड इंस्क्रिप्शन का लास्ट पैराग्राफ लास्ट पैराग्राफ में यहां से मार्क करेंगे सिक्स लाइन दे प्रोवाइड अस ऑथेंटिक इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट इंपॉर्टेंट इवेंट्स इंपॉर्टेंट डेट्स द पर्सनल क्वालिटीज ऑफ द रूलर्स द म्यूचुअल रिलेशंस of different rulers about the specimen of art and the administrative measures this is answer number 61 give reason first question okay now question number 2 the medieval period is fixed between 8th century to 18th century this answer is on page number 3 come on page number 3 here you will mark there first side last paragraph here last second line the 8th century in india is definitely a century of change when everywhere whether in the political social or economic 
fields a great many changes were taking place Similarly, the breakup of the Mughal Empire and the coming of the British in power. Till here, you will write there. This is answer number, part, question number 6, 2. Now, question number 3. Memoirs are an important historical source of knowledge. Why? Here also, come on page number 5. You can mark from here. Memoirs are an important historical source of knowledge. After that, page number 5, second side. Here, you can look, look there. 8th line, which tell us many important things about different rulers in the first person. Okay, this is the answer number 6, 3rd. This lesson completed now. We will start now next day, lesson number 2 of history. You will read it. You will learn question answers of lesson of 1 and complete your work. That will be good for you.